Good day people, welcome back to my YouTube channel Elliot Wave Green. I'm your host Shaheen. In today's video we are going to look at silver. It looks to me that silver is going to present a very strong and a amazing opportunity to trade. As far as the long term trend is concerned we already know that we probably have created a bottom right over here and right now we are going to the correction phase of this impulse wave structure right over here. From the top I have uh, uh, again angles made from the top and then we have been looking at very important supports and uh, very important resistance points so right now we are going to look at uh, GAN anal Elliott analysis and see where exactly the Elliott analysis our last analysis for short term price analysis did not go the way we thought we thought the price will continue downward but instead we have seen the price jump upward so this has made me re, uh, rethink the price structure of the correction. Right now I'm considering that this is wave 1, wave 2, wave 3, wave 4 and wave 5. Wave 5 being truncated and that makes it a leading diagonal. So we have a leading diagonal wave 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. That makes me think that probably we have only created completed one part of the correction right now we are going to the second part of the correction and then we'll complete the third part of the correction the reason I'm indicating all the way downward is of a very important and uh, common uh, pattern of Elliott wave analysis is called a flat pattern in flat pattern we get we have sing smart wave like this and we have wave B like this and we have wave C like this that's the thing. In addition to this structure that I'm seeing right over here, from the top of, uh, from the top of this top, I'm considering this as wave A, B, C, wave A, B, C, and I'm expecting that we'll have some more price movement in upward. And when that price movement is finished, we'll start seeing price moving downward. And that, if you look at it, uh, the downward price movement target is not somewhere over here but instead right over here all the way down over here from where the correction started the reason I'm showing is we have a very important uh, uh, trading setup coming up in silver is because if you look at the ups right at the top we don't have a lot of room left all right in that case if the price is as I'm expecting they are going to go a little up and probably create a double top with this one if you look at it we have not created a double top yet on top of it uh, as regarding to this one we have a top right over here which is a little low so there is a possibility that we might have another push forward on Monday uh, I'm considering this whole price movement as wave A, wave B and then this considering I'm sorry I'm considering this as wave A this is wave B and I'm considering this whole price movement as an ending diagonal so if you look at a 30 minute chart we have wave A, B, C, wave 1, wave 2, wave 3 wave 4 and that's what I'm expecting that we are going to have probably another push upward once we do go upward and create a double top with this one for this price movement then the upward stop loss area is not as big and that makes it a quite a very good trading setup for price to reverse so this is gonna be this is what I'm expecting in silver once that is happened then we'll uh, see where exactly the prices are gonna go after that so silver is presenting a very good short setup that's what I'm expecting at least but be careful with the price structure be careful with the uh, important support and resistance as far as the traditional structure is concerned if you look at it we are can see inverse head and shoulder pattern so this is head this is left shoulder this is right shoulder this is perfect neckline and we have seen prices gone up if that is actually the head and shoulder pattern then we can actually look at this pattern right over here and then we can say that the target is gonna be somewhere downward right over here and if we see where exactly that target is that takes us right over here in that regard I won't think that it's gonna go that deep I would think that it's gonna come and find an important support because this is quite an important support right over here thank you so much for visiting this is the combination of GAN and this is the combination of Elliott wave analysis that I'm tool I'm expecting 
if you have not seen my larger time price movement I'm expecting that we might have created a bottom right over here and this is wave one of a next larger cycle wave and I'm expecting that right now we are going to go through wave two there is a possibility that if we have not created a bottom right over here we might create a new bottom but for the timing I'm not expecting that we are going to see higher prices in silver thank you so much for visiting have a good one and bye bye